Well, that's how you know women, the women that are so okay with their bodies, which I love. Thank you. And here's the big thing on that. Move your feet. <laughs> Music to my ears. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right, gang. We're about ready to go. Quick little check, okay? Stay with me. Every boudoir photographer's dream, the airbed. Of course, we have a case of water. We also have some wardrobe here. We have, of course, the important gear that we have to have with us. Um, also a stool that was made by my brother. But the most important thing of the entire evening, of course, is a box of wine. So we're on our way to the second collaborative um, since we have started this local meetup. The first one was uber successful. So excited that um, for the first one that we had the turnout that we did. It was horrible weather, so I was really, really chewing my nails on that one. This one, I'm so happy to say, we have actually quadrupled the number of people that are coming tonight, which is really cool. Tonight we'll be teaching flow posing. There are going to be live models. And what I really hope everybody takes away from tonight is a little bit more confidence in how to pose their clients. I really feel like um, flow posing, particularly if you're a newer boudoir photographer or editorial style photographer, um, understanding flow posing and have those having those sort of tricks in your in your pocket um, really helps you gain confidence and flow easily from one pose to the next. Things that you can count on, which are super important. That is what I am looking forward to tonight. It's the people. Like, I have no fears on my cat naked from a bunch of strangers. I'm just like, I feel really good. I feel like I look good. <laughs> I've pretty much talked to every single one of you, but welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome tonight. Um, welcome to Hip at the Flashlight Factory. Welcome to the Pittsburgh Collaborative. So I'm gonna teach you some things here and then we're gonna break you up into groups and then we're gonna go over there. Why do we like flow posing? First of all, it's easy. Once you get your like your bag of tricks, so like I have 22 flow poses that I do at any given time. I don't always dip into that bag, but if I do, if I, when I want to, I know it's there. And I know these poses so well and they are poses that like everybody looks good in. So you don't ever have to worry about like, oh my gosh, like she's just not gonna look good at, Everybody looks good in these poses. So that's what a flow pose is. It's gonna give your client a ton of variety. It's gonna allow you to work with efficiency and it's going to um, also just be able to give you confidence. Okay? Shall we go? Let's boogie. You, when you are taking your turn to photograph, if you just wanna ask her to close it, just ask her to close it. Okay? It's all whatever you want. Okay. I'm gonna show you my flow poses if you're like, what would happen? If I totally turn her around or put her in front of the window or whatever, go ahead. That's up to you. Now I always, do you see how she has her ankles together? Every time I have a girl go toe up, she goes like this. Drives me nuts. Keep those ankles together. That's the Betty Boop. That is like just a more elegant, I feel, than this. A bit more if you can. I like this one to be up because I like that curve. Because you've got her curve here, here, here. The more curves that I can put in my model, I feel like the more flattering it is. The largest thing in my photograph is her bum. Sometimes that works out. Depends on the model. Sometimes it doesn't. Just be aware. Some women will see a photo like that and be like, holy Moses, my ass looks like the side of a building. <laughs> some are like, woo, I finally have one. And some are like, oh my gosh, delete that. Okay, you guys ready to get started? how amazing they're doing. You should never quit. Oh, sorry, babe. You should never stop talking. 
Lift that chin. Oh, you got it. That's right. Look right at me. That's beautiful. Oh my God, you look so gorgeous. Wait until you see this photo. That's right. Kick that hip out a little bit more. Now play in your hair. You got it. Look down. Look to the side. Look right at me again. Holy Moses, you look incredible. Jesus, Lord, do you have a beautiful rack. You say whatever it is you want to say. I've never seen an ass like that, that bodysuit. And I'm telling you, every single woman is like, thank you. But when I was over there, I was like, thanks, the model. Like, I just want to give a big shout out to the model.